hi guys welcome to my channel my name is amanda if you are new here if you're not new welcome back thank you guys for clicking on this video and being here with me today i'm going to be sharing my monthly favorites even though some of these have leaked into this month um just a few items but most of it's from last month that i've purchased um that i wanted to share with you so these are just like some food related items some lifestyle fitness clothing all that good stuff and skincare so if you want to see the lifestyle portion stay tuned till the end of the video that's when i'll share it but first we're gonna jump right into my favorite food related items um so to start off i'm gonna start off with beverages that's always just like the easiest lately i've been really liking doing cold tea so this is my absolute favorite tea this is peppermint tea and you can have it hot but in florida you never want to have anything hot really um cold drinks are just so refreshing so i just brew it in a mason jar and i store it in the fridge i add a little bit of uh, zero calorie sweetener so you could do liquid sweetener you could do splenda you could do whatever you like um you could even sweeten it with agave or sugar-free maple syrup um, and it's just so good and peppermint i think is the best one you can even add fresh mint to it would be really really good um, so yeah, that's currently my favorite beverage, um, that I've really been enjoying. And then next we're going to do some sauces. I think I only really have two sauces to show you. One is which, um, that I make myself. It's amazing. It's my favorite sauce in the world. And I've showed it quite a bit in my What I Eat in a Days and I've shared the recipe. I'll make sure to leave the link down below on how to make it and where you can find it. But this is my vegan nacho cheese sauce. I don't know if you can really see it, but this is a big container and it's all made of plant-based food and seasoning. Um, and it's amazing. You can have one fourth cup for two smart points and it makes 15 servings. It's literally made of vegetables, some nutritional yeast, soaked cashews and seasoning. That's it. I like to have it on salads. I like to dip veggies in it. I like to have it with potato fries. Um, and I like make kind of like a nacho plate with it. Um, if you're vegan or vegetarian, or if, even if you're not, this sauce is seriously amazing, and it's really good for you, um, and I love it. So I've been making that literally every week. I make a big batch of it. <laughs> and then the next sauce is the new G. Hughes Sweet and Spicy flavor. Now, I know I said the hickory was my favorite, but the sweet and spicy is my new favorite because I like spice. It's so good. It's sugar-free, so you could have quite a bit for very, very low in points. And you can have pizza. You can make, um, you know, like barbecue pizza and have grilled chicken nuggets with it or whatever you prefer. But I really love it. And even on mac and cheese is really good. Um, and then this is the best hummus. This is our third container. We have been going through this nonstop. I've even gotten some family members hooked on it. This is the Boar's Head Sweet Chili Garlic Hummus. I get this from Publix. I think that's the only place that carries Boar's Head. I, I could be wrong on that, but that's where I've, the only place I've found it. And it's amazing. It's so good. The best hummus, hands down. And then <laughs> this is random, but I've been like eating canned soup for dinner. It's just so easy, so quick, so comforting. And this is the Light Progresso Chicken Noodle. This one's my favorite and I literally just love it and I add saltine crackers to it. Um, you can have this whole can for two smart points. And Progresso also has lots of good light soups and this one's just my favorite. And then I recently just picked, this is one of the products I actually, that's kind of leaked into this month. Um, but this is the unsweetened applesauce from Publix. It's the Green Wise. This is just the, the container because I only have two left, so I just took it out of the packaging. But unsweetened applesauce with a little bit of dash of cinnamon is so good. So let's do the snack. So I'm sure you guys have seen this before, but this one's my favorite, the Fiber One Cinnamon Brownie Bar. This is such a good sweet treat. Um, I love it heated up in the microwave for literally like six seconds. That's all it needs. Um, these are two smart points. They have lemon and chocolate, but the cinnamon one I personally think is the best. And I've been loving these. And they're always buy one, get one free at Publix. So love that. And then this is a great option for snacks. I love these. And what I've been doing is doing one bag for four smarts, four smart points. And then I do the Pitos, Fiery Cheetos, or Fiery Onion Rings, which I'll leave a picture of that here. I don't have the packaging because I went through them like that. And they're gone. And I didn't save any, <laughs> but I mix the two so you get like spicy and then like this like kind of milds it down a little bit. But I love these little pre-packaged 
Cheez-Its and I get these at Aldi. Publix has them and I think Target does as well. Um, and then I add the little Pitos Fiery Hot, so good. Another thing that we've been loving with the sweet chili hummus is these reduced fat Triscuits. They're really good, they're really thick and they fill you up pretty fast. Um, so they're a little bit higher in points, but I feel like, I don't know, they satisfy me more because it's more cracker and they're not super, super thin. So it's a good option if you want something a little bit more filling and they just taste really good. So we've been having that with the hummus. And then we have a lot of bars. We, I was on like a bar kick, like trying out all these bars, even though I really only found one brand I really, really, really loved. Um, but tone it up. Um, I like the texture. I don't really taste that much protein. I mean, a little mild protein taste, but the texture is really good. This is my first favorite. The birthday cake tone it up bar is so good. This is the first one that I tried and I loved this one. And then the second favorite is the dark chocolate sea salt. This is my second favorite. This one's so, so good. I love this one. And I get these all from Target. And then the third favorite is the white chocolate macadamia. This one's definitely salty and more nutty. Um, and it's just really good. All their bars are so good, I think, and they have really good texture. Um, they're more like airy and like rice crispy-ish. I, I don't really know how to explain it, but they kind of look similar to the Alani New Bars. They look very similar to that, um, but a little bit different, but I really love them. And then this bar is so good for dessert. This is the Elevation Caramel Double Chocolate Crunch Bar. Um, I got this from Aldi and I'm obsessed. This one is so good. I've tried a lot of Elevation bars, but this one by far is my favorite. There we go. And it has caramel in it. And when you bite into it, you can like see the caramel. It's so satisfying. It's only five smart points and it's amazing. And then another drink item is this reduced calorie hot chocolate. I've been really loving hot chocolate in my coffee. When I do have warm coffee, I like to add one of these in there. So good. Love Swiss Miss reduced fat hot chocolate. A breakfast item that I love and my husband also love these. These are the Kashi cinnamon waffles. You can have two for five and they're really, really good. I love the cinnamon flavor. I think it's amazing. I like to add banana, what they do on the, the front of this, banana, cinnamon, and maple syrup. That's how I like it. So good. Love that one. And then another current favorite is the original chicken Boca Burger patty in the air fryer on a ranch and buffalo salad. I like to cut this up. It's so good. I really don't do sandwiches with it. I just use it as a salad like protein source. Um, but the Boca Burger is really good. Um, the beef patty, they have a spicy chicken that's really good. And this one, which I really like, the original. Love it. And then my favorite, current favorite Yasso bar is the black raspberry chip. This one is so, so good. Um, I've tried so many Yasso bars, so, so many. And this one just like knocks it out of the park. I think that's pretty much all like the food stuff. And then I'm gonna show you guys some lifestyle stuff. The two things I wanted to share are some items um, that I'm, I'm just so happy that I was introduced to this company. This is Iron Flask. We have two Iron Flask. This one's mine, the green ombre one. I've shared this in a video, but I wanted to give it its own little um, introduction. Um, this is the 40 ounce. I believe it's 40 ounces. It's really, really big. Keeps my drink so cold. My water like never gets warm. I go out to the pool. I bring this. It does not get warm. Um, even my husband's super impressed. We've tried a lot of like insulation insulated bottles and this one's the best um they reached out to me they gave me a code for you guys i bought them before even working with them and i tried them out and i really liked them and then they reached out and offered me a code so i do have a code for you guys if you're interested and you're in need of a water bottle that stays really cold this is my husband's this is 22 ounce it's tall and skinny it fits in your cup holder and it also fits in like the gym workout machines they have a huge bottle, it's like 60 ounces. I, I opt to get that one just because it didn't fit in the workout machines and this one does, the 40 ounce. Um, but they do have a 60 ounce option for you. But the 22 ounce fits great. All right, 
Next is like my second favorite besides food is like skincare. Um, I recently switched up my skincare to Coco Kind. Um, so a lot of my skincare products, besides a few things, are Coco Kind. Now this is the oil to melt cleanser and you can um, get this at Target by the way or you can order it online. Sometimes you can get it off Amazon but usually I get it at Target or I just order from Coco Kind. But this is the oil to melt cleanser and this is a great great cleanser for dry skin it starts off as oil and then you add some water to it and it starts to turn into like a soap um, or milk cleanser um, and it gets white and it's just so gentle it's not high in fragrance and I love it that's probably one of my favorite cleansers I've tried and then I moisturize with this chia facial oil um, by coca kind which has omega-3 and it's just so gentle it smells delicious it's great for sensitive skin great for hydration and it's a really high quality oil um, and I've clearly if you can see I've been loving it and then the next two products are so so cool this is a matcha stick and if you don't know I love matcha I love me my matcha um, this is a hydration balm so you can put it under your eyes, you can put it on your lips, dry patches. It's really for all over your face, wherever you need it. And this is what the stick looks like. It's really, really big. Like there's so much product in this. Um, and I love this so much. I use it literally every single day. And then this is so neat. This is a turmeric mask stick. So you can put it on you can leave it on for 15 minutes or 30 minutes or I mean I've left it on for like 35 minutes before because um, it's just such a gentle mask um, and it does not stain your skin or anything because there's turmeric in it I kind of thought maybe it would stain my skin but it hasn't I've used it literally like every day for weeks um, and I have no issues with it so this is a turmeric mask stick and it's just for um, problem areas this is what it looks like it's really really yellow um, this is the label and I just think my skin looks so good after I use it it looks so bright um, and I'm obsessed so I think that's so cool too that it's a mask and a stick I think that's really neat um, so that's for the skincare and then for hair okay I am a firm believer that this hair product has changed the game for my hair. My hair has never looked so healthy and shiny. It looks so good. I put this on after I shower. My hair is damp and I let it air dry and it just looks so, so good and less frizzy. This is the Kristen S. Weightless Shine Working Serum for frizz taming, cuticle smoothing, and moisturizing locks. I am going to purchase more of her products because I'm so impressed with this one. I am going to start, I think I'm going to switch my shampoo and conditioner to this and try some more products. So I'll keep you guys updated in another favorites video maybe. I'll show you um, more products if I like it from her. But this I am so impressed by and I highly recommend. I think it was $14.99 but it is the best serum I have ever tried. It's so good. And then next are just two little beauty products. They're lipsticks. You guys. Um, comment on my lips a lot and <laughs> thank you um but i just use tinted moisturizer balms um i don't really use gloss very much only on occasion because it's so sticky um and these are just so pretty these are sheer slick elf um tinted balms this is the grapefruit that i have on today is what i'm wearing and it's just a really pretty pink color as you can see and it's just it's not sticky you just put it on and it's just very natural and leaves a really pretty tint and that's my favorite I love that and they're very affordable and they're cruelty free so that's a big plus and this one's called wild peach this one's a tad bit darker but it's just so natural and so pretty I love this one Oh, this looks really pretty on um, and they just feel really really good and airy and I love them so those are the two lip products and then we're gonna go over some clothes just some like normal everyday clothes and then also some fitness related clothes but I wanted to show you guys this bathing suit I will leave this link down below for you um, it's very affordable and it is it just looks so good on. Again, I ordered this a little bit a few months ago, but I've been going to the beach and wearing this nonstop. So I wanted to share this in a monthly favorites. 
but it's a light pastel purple polka dot bikini. It has some string ties, which are adorable, and it is just so comfy on. Now, it doesn't have any padding in it, so it's not, like, it's super, super supportive, but even for someone as big chested as me, I still think it looks flattering, maybe because of the ties. You can, like, really tighten it up. Um, but also because it's just straight across. It just looks so good. And then these trunks, <laughs> trunks, these bottoms are so like high waisted. They also cover the butt nice. Like, I don't know. I just feel very comfortable in this bathing suit and I was surprised at how affordable it was. So I wanted to share that. And also I think it's just a beautiful, beautiful color. That pastel purple is gorgeous and then this is a skirt I recently bought and I'm obsessed I think it's just very versatile because it's black and white with polka dots but I wear it with oversized shirts how am I doing this <laughs> it's black and white polka dots and it has like a little bottom frill to it if you can see that like right here like it's black under and then it has the sheer polka dot to it so I don't know it is just the cutest skirt and I like to wear it with oversized shirts. I think it looks so cute with oversized like band shirts with this and some like black or white sandals or sneakers even. Um, you can also tuck a black or white shirt in, a tank top, but I really think it's just so so cute and versatile. It's on sale. I got this from Nasty Gal um, and I wanted to share it because it's a current favorite little skirt and it was really affordable. And then also, I posted a picture of a blue, beautiful blue dress. I will insert a picture here because it's in the wash right now, so I can't show you. But I'll show you what it looks like on me in this picture on the screen. It is gorgeous and it's on sale. So I wanted to share that because a lot of you guys really liked that photo and asked where I got the dress. So I will leave a link down below for you guys. And then next is some workout gear from Yvette. You guys know that's what I wear to work out in. I'm going to share some bras with you. I love all of their bras. They're so good. They have low, medium, and high support. This is a black one. This is a newer one. I have ones that look like this, but this one is different because of the straps right here and they're adjustable and a little bit thicker of a strap on the back. I really like black bras. They just look really nice on me. And then this one's super cute. It's gray and black with a mesh detail on the top and a circle cut out in the back. This one looks great with black leggings, gray leggings, white leggings, if you dare to wear white leggings. <laughs> and then this bra I wore the other night to work out and I loved it. This is what it looks like. It is high support. It is so nice and this is the back and then you can adjust it on the side here and I really like the color it's kind of like a mauve gray to me like it's a, just a different style gray and it's very breathable and it just fits really well this one is by my by far my favorite because it's light support and I can wear it around the house and it looks so stinking cute on it's black and white stripe it's just really really cute I haven't quite seen a bra like this and I love it um, it's very very soft and comfortable and again I can wear it around the house which is an A plus for me because I like to wear sports bras instead of wired push-up bras or things like that and then these leggings are the best leggings I've tried from Yvette ever I worked out in them the other night at the gym and I, I walked, I ran, I squatted. I love them. They're squat proof. They stay up. They don't fall down. They have a strand here you can tighten and they have a really nice back like it kind of V's down and it has the logo so I like that. They're high waisted and the best part is they have a pocket for your phone so your phone can go in there and then it's so flattering they have a mesh design on the side of the calf so there's a mesh design on the side and it just looks so good and like I said these are the best leggings that I've tried from them and yeah I love them these are going to be a new favorite I work out in and they are high support so that's what I really like is high support so that it stays up, fits good, and I feel confident when I'm working out. So check it out. I will leave these items down in the description box as well as their website and a discount code for you guys to save some money if you're in need of some good workout but affordable clothing. 
All right, guys, that is everything for this favorites video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. That helps me out so much, and I appreciate it. Subscribe if you're not. I would love to have you here, and thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're doing well, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.